The next day so guys it's the next day and um i know that i didn't start this vlog properly i just thought to fill you guys in on what is happening i got a job in the uk <laughs> and you know that once you have once you get a job like that they require you to bring some kind of document that will help you process your visa and um here yeah, so part of the document is your tuberculosis test um, certificate and so that's what i went to do yesterday it was very stressful yesterday, although not as stressful as I thought it was going to be. Um, even though it was seamless, I know the part that was so stressful was the waiting time. So I got in there around, I got to um, Ikeja, which is the IOM, around I think 6.15, 6.15 a.m. I got in there quite early because my appointment was for 7 o'clock. So I needed to be there as early as possible. One thing I didn't do, if I had known I would have done that, I'm going to be telling you guys how to do that. So I filled the form and I paid online. But one thing I didn't do, I did not print out the pay, proof of payment because that's part of the things you're going to be doing. So after you finish paying, when you're going for your the day of your appointment, before that they try to print out your um, proof of payment and your front page of your international passport which is the data page of international passport and you also print out your proof of appointment that you were given appointment if you don't do all that they might likely not let you in or oh, it, it will be stressful for you because you have to go and print out like you have to go and print them out you know that was what delayed me somehow proof of payment and your front page of international passport which i did and they also tell you to um proof that they gave you appointment for that day proof that you were given appointment for that day which i also did that really delayed me at least it took like 20 minutes away from the time that i've been attended to it's better you do it from the house to avoid all that stress people that always do the printing they don't come in until let's say 7 30. after you show this they will now let you into the premises something like this they give you a number from that's the number you're going to use till you finish your test till you are done from that place so my number was number 39 you will see that there's a barcode here and there's a link here so this barcode you scan the barcode and this link here will come up once it come up there's a form that follows the link alongside to just pop out and you need to fill those form in the form they have to you give them your information which is your name your your age your passport number where you are traveling to where you're going to be working the company's um, phone number and all that and make sure that there's no mistake once you're done with that you take it to another office where you need to confirm this information at least they'll show you what you did you know once they show you what you did what you feel if there's any mistake you need to correct it immediately if you don't correct it immediately once they print it out or once they you know enter if you come back for correction I think they'll charge you a fee so after that they'll just take you to i think they'll give you this um proof of after they show you all that they'll now print out this receipt for this is your receipt that shows that you paid you know yeah for the tb test and after that you see a doctor doctor would ask you some questions do you have tuberculosis do your parents have tuberculosis so they'll now direct you to a place where you wait for them to scan you the scanning will take up to like 10 minutes the only thing that got me so tired, frustrated, and exhausted was after the scanning, they'll tell you to wait. That waiting is for like three hours, guys. You wait for like three hours before you get your test result. And this, I waited for three hours. I was so tired. If you can see the previous clip, you see everything. You see how people were still waiting. You know, the crowd was, people were crowded. People came with kids. If you're going with your kids, please just go with food and water because <laughs> that three hours waiting, they will feel cranky. So you have to make sure that you have everything that will make them feel very comfortable and not give you stress because it's always tiring, very tiring and all that. So after I waited for like three hours, they gave me my um, test results. This, <laughs> But this is the test results. This is uh, this is how it comes, you know, 
this is how it comes say please do not fold please do not laminate please do not tamper with the hologram you know submit with other documents to the embassy remember to take the certificates with you when traveling so this is what you're going to take with you when you are traveling so i think the price of this if you want to pay online even if you're not paying online the price is i paid i don't know how much it will be now but i paid fifty-seven thousand eight hundred naira that's what i paid for my tb test and that's it guys so these are the documents i'm going to use to apply for my cos because that's what they are going to request for and um and other documents so my employer requested for this and other documents and that's it guys i was able to do this right now what i'll be waiting for will be my cos fingers crossed <laughs> the waiting for this interview was long because i kept calling the company um i'm still waiting is there no is there still recruitment you know back to back back to back and i was given positive answer even after the interview it took you know time you know feeling this from feeling nerve and all that so what i'll be waiting for right now fingers crossed is my cos and um ah guys i don't know what to say but I will let you guys know once I get my COS. I don't know, but once I send this out, I will let you guys know when I get my COS. Hi, guys. <laughs> I'm back again and I'm back with good news. <laughs> guys, I've just been screaming. I'm super excited, guys. So, so, so excited. So, the last time I spoke to you guys, I uh, was um, three days. I went to do my TB test, and um, which was already done. And I told, I also told you guys that I was using that TB test to apply for my CEO. I sent everything to them on the fifth of September, you know, and they, I was told that I would get it as soon as possible, <laughs> you know. And I know that I've heard other people say they get their TB test under two weeks, some say under one week. You know, but guys, guess what? Today is the 19th of December. <laughs> 19th of December and I got my series today. I just got the mail today and guys, I have been screaming. It took like three months, like good three months plus for me to get my series. Apparently they said the home office has been very busy. I know that they're trying to scrutinize or they're trying to make sure that they get the series to the right company because of all this scam. During that period of waiting, I kept calling my employer and I kept sending them emails but thankfully they always respond to me they sent it they are still awaiting the home office home office is busy once it is done they will get back to me I, I make sure I, I send them a mail once in a month or twice in a month just so that I am still keeping in touch to know what's going on so it took like September October November and today is the 19th guys of December I got my series I'm so excited like why waiting I was just saying god please you started this thing don't let it end you know you started this journey don't don't just stop halfway and guys i'm so excited because god just came through for me like this is god at work i'm so happy because three months plus hey <laughs> i'm super super excited i don't even know how to even hold my joy but <laughs> i'm just staying here to just because I'm, I'm not if you see me since i've been jumping and dancing and praising god you know i'm so happy guys i'm super excited to get this um so the next thing i'm going to be doing now is to apply for my visa because that's what you're supposed to use to apply for your visa without that the you can't apply that so it's a sponsorship job so you can't apply without that and i would definitely keep you guys updated i just thought to come in here and fill you guys in and give you guys the update <laughs> i would definitely let you guys know when i'm filling the form or when i'm applying for my visa i will definitely apply for my visa today because i can't wait i will start the application today because today is 19th i don't know if they're going to go for a holiday i don't know if they're going to go on holiday so I need to start applying immediately so that I can pick a date for my biometric. Hi guys, good morning, welcome back. Um, today is 2nd of January and it's the time is about 11, past 11, yes, past 11 o'clock. And it's my biometric day, guys. <laughs> yes, today is my appointment day for my biometric and... Um, 
yeah my appointment is for 1 30 and the time is after 11 so i need to leave the house as early as possible i know that i was going to fill you guys in while i was filling my visa application but i, I couldn't do that because there was no light like i had to find a way to fill the form there was no light and my journey is bad so it was so it was too much for me like it was too much for me i was not happy at all but anyway we were able to fill the form i uploaded all my documents that needed to be uploaded i scanned them and uploaded them and um yeah so my appointment day is today i can't believe this is happening but guys it's happening it's amazing how god just let it seamless even if it seems as if it was difficult but god made it so seamless for me and easy and smooth like i'm grateful to god anyway today is that day i am heading to ikeja right now i'm going to tls ikeja and i don't want to get there late because they said get there 15 minutes to your appointments don't get there too early get there 15 minutes to the appointment because if you get there too early nobody will attend to you until your time and my time is for 1 30 so yeah i hope i don't meet so much crowd i know that there's always crowd there according to what i heard but let's see how it goes i would definitely carry you guys along with me if it's possible but if not when i get back i will fill you guys in and let you guys know what um how it went and all that yeah i thought to give you guys the update and to let you guys know every process um here yeah, guys i will speak to you guys when i get there i don't want to get there late when i get there i will definitely speak with you guys bye hi guys good morning guys i look so tired this morning i look so pale my under eye is so inside like my eyes are inside i barely slept yesterday in fact i slept this morning i had so much to do yesterday night that i slept this morning i woke up around um, i slept around 5 30 imagine woke up around six o'clock <laughs> that's 30 minutes of sleep woke up prepped the kids for school and um here yeah, i had to go back to bed again for like two hours and the time now is um i think after to 11 yeah time is to 11 and anyway guys good morning um guys yesterday i went to the market to do my normal monthly food supply while i was in the market that morning i got a mail from tls stating that my travel document is ready for pickup i was told to come do the pickup i couldn't do that yesterday because of the market errand so today is the 12th of um of january i did my application on the second beginning of the year on the second and today is 12 so i'm going i'm going to do my pickup this morning it's been a a waiting time like i cannot believe that this is coming to reality guys i'm <laughs> i'm still overwhelmed i'm going to tls right now to pick up my documents when i get back i will definitely show you guys much 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 later so guys i just got back in like an hour or so an hour ago the sun is just too much like the sun is really up like hey this one is i don't know it's on gt whether it's nj mensa or nj kofi but this sun <laughs> is not smiling that is it's too much may like go i just went to the bathroom straight took my bath and i just want to show you guys what i went to do i have collected it and so let's open this together and see what well, see i've been anxious to open it but let me come and open it with you guys and show you guys what um just so that we can open it together basically yeah so 
let me open it and show you guys see okay it comes like this and nothing again inside oh god where's the body <laughs> guys this is it this is it i'm so excited like it's done stamped and <laughs> oh my god everything is stamped like guys i'm so excited see me so serious what's my face serious like this <laughs> oh i don't want to shout but i'm happy thank you jesus i'm so excited thank you god thank you jesus you made this happen see god made this happen not me the fact that i'm i'm giving like this because we have been screaming since anyway i'm excited like i am excited i don't know how to express it but i'm really excited i'm happy i may not really show it here but trust me guys i'm so happy i'm so excited that this is a big one for me and my family is something that i've been praying for like i can't believe that this is coming to reality how it started i do not even know and now it's ending in praise it's ending in good testimony it's ending in success like i am so grateful to god and i say thank you jesus because you did this one <laughs> because i know how it is i know how it is i know how it is but jesus did this one i didn't pay a dime like i did not pay a dime to get this job i just you know got it by the grace of god and um did the interview you know follow every process like every process smoothly and god was just directing me god was just giving me directions god was just showing me what i want to do it's been long coming since oh since june you know this thing started and i thought that maybe by september i would have been gone or october but this is me in new year for anyone who is praying for this same miracle or who is wishing to get this you are still waiting for your cos or your visa application i pray that god hasten it and give you speed and favor you in the name of jesus that's it guys i thank you so much for your support and the next thing i'll be doing now is to start you know buying things for travel and all that and i will definitely carry you guys along in my next vlog uh thank you so much guys for watching thank you for watching to this point please do not forget to subscribe like this video leave your comments anything you need to know you let me know in the comment section i'll be glad to give you that answer and yeah thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next one bye